So we are grateful. Does exceedingly abundantly above all things that we can ask or think. So we're grateful today. Father God, we bless you. We thank you. We give you glory and honor. You deserve the praise, God. It all belongs to you. We thank you for our life, our health, and our strength. We thank you once again, allowing us to come together, to be united as one, to bless your holy name. We thank you, God, for today that you've created. We definitely will rejoice and be glad in it. We know, God, that you are our Father, which art in heaven. Hallowed be thy holy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Oh God, we ask that you give us, oh God, this day that you have created, our daily bread. Forgive us our debt as we forgive our debt to us. Lead us not, oh God, into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory. We bless you, God. We glorify you. We magnify you, and God, we definitely lift up your name. For you are our Savior, and you are our strength. You, God, are our shield, and you are the lifter of our head. Our problems, our situations, our circumstances. Oh, God, our hardships and our heartaches and our pains, God, we give them to you. Knowing that you can do better with them than we can. And, God, we thank you for giving us victory through all our, all our situations. We thank you. We thank you for our children. and We thank you for our homes and our cars. and We thank you, God, for our job. We thank you for being a great God. And we give your name the praise. We ask God that you bless us in this place today. As we sing songs of worship and praise. As the man of God preach your word. As we read scriptures and God as we, oh God, lift our hands. We pray that you be satisfied with what we give you today. We thank you. We praise you. We give you glory and honor because God, it belongs to you. And this is our servant prayer. And all of God's people say amen. 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 And amen. Jesus. 
receiving instruction in prudent behavior, doing what is right, just and fair, for giving prudence to those who are simple, knowledge and discretion to the young. Let the wise listen and add to their learning. And let the discerning get guidance for understanding proverbs and parables, mm -hmm. sayings and riddles of the wise. Mm -hmm. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. Yes. The fear of the Lord is the beginning yes. of yes. knowledge. Yes. But fools, mm -hmm. but fools mm -hmm. despise wisdom and instructions. Mm -hmm. I just read for you Proverbs 1, verses 1 through 7. I pray this doesn't fall on deaf ears. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Just sure you say amen. 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 Once again, good morning and happy new year. It's a new beginning. Every day is a new beginning. How the Lord has blessed us and kept us. Our hymn this morning we coming from 234. Guide me, O thou great Jehovah. Pilgrim through this barren land. I am weak, but thou art mighty. And hold me with thy powerful hand. Bread of heaven, bread of heaven, feed me until I want no more. <clears throat> Guide me, oh, thou great dream, oh,
come this morning with bowed heads within my heart. Where we come giving you thanks for all of the many blessings yes, that God has yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. Then we come sucker confessing that we have sinned, that we are not walk, neither have we are dog, as you have to command it to children. Yes, Lord. So we want to thank you, Father, you have not judged us according to our deeds and our action. Yes, Lord. But Father God, you can turn things to deal with us with tender love, God and mercy, and we come yeah, to give yeah, yeah. you come praise and thank you for your name and worthy to be praised. Yes, Lord. But we thank you, Father, that you have brought us through 21, my Father God. We are beginning 22. Yes, Lord. Yes. Not only that you brought us through 21, but Father God, you brought us from our early existence until this yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. We know wherever we end up, Father God, we know that you are going to be the one that will carry us. You are. So, Father God, we come now lean in the pen and trucking in you for any yes. lies that you are God and that you do and you so for the entire universe. Yes. We want to thank you, Father, you look beyond all thank our performance, and Father Lord. God, you have applied all our needs. Yes. Thank, thank you, Father, Lord. that you let us realize that we did not bring not by ourselves to where we are, but Father God, if your love, your mercy, your grace that yeah. allowed us to be here today. Be here today, God. We yeah. pray in this name. We pray today. Father God, we come praying your blessing upon the same man that has the hope. Yeah. We pray your blessing upon the one that is absent from among us as well as the one that is present. Yeah. Not only that we pray your blessing upon the same man, yeah. but Father God, we pray Father your God. blessing upon all of the church of all of the names that are teaching the poor and you hold in your divine command to uplift your holy yeah. hand. We pray, Father God, that we will not hard in our heart that they hear the day of provocation. But Father God, those things which you have commanded to children and do and not all the devil will do those things, but Father God, we will find to our lives that we might go to the night, that the world might see that you feel ill, but that you live in us and just how much of us. We pray your blessing upon the unshepherd which you have called in a pain and a place to lead your children according to the Lord and in the vine. We pray, Father God, they will not mean some good they are not understand. But Father God, we pray that as your holy and divine people will be in God and direct them, Father God, that they will send hope to the Lord to the command of the And Father God, we mean your time. We say if we ever needed, but needed the Lord, we sure need you now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then, Father God, we pray for the sick, the sick, and the one that yeah. they're behind yeah. the yeah. 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 And let us all rely you do, and you do the super rule yeah. 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 And let us rely, Father God, that whatever yeah. we need, let us rely that it's all in you. Yeah. Yeah. And let us rely, Father God, that it become an impossibility for man. But Father God, we know that nothing too hard to do. Not only that, God, we have been out of trust and believed in the kingdom of you. Yes, sir. Yes, Lord, you are the only one that we pray for. We rely, Father God, we cannot lean and depend on the sun itself. We rely, Father God, that our government can't help us out of what we can. 
And today, but Father God, we realize that you is able, and Father God, you know all yeah. things and all. You have power over all things, oh Father God. That's why we are calling on you because Father God, you that we need to follow and just have a much of us. Then Father God, then one day we all must come down to the end, Father God. And Father God, when we come down to the end of this time, we pray, Father God, that God will give us a home. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, sir.
The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The main stand for doxology. Praise God from whom all blessings flow.
that one more time. I pray for.
spirit. Sweet heavenly God, stay right here with us. Fill us with your love. God, we need to be revived today. We need to be revived today. We need your spirit, God. We need your spirit, God. Is there anybody who can declare I need your spirit, God? Come on, y'all, come on. Let praise is rise. Let praise is rise. Let praise is rise. Let the glory of the Lord rise among us. Let the praise of my team rise among us. Lift up your head, O ye gates. Come on, y'all. And be ye lifted up. And the King of glory, hallelujah, and the King of glory, he shall come in. Who is the King of glory? The Lord God, strong and mighty. The Lord God, mighty in battle. He is the King of glory. Hallelujah. 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 Don't worry, we ain't moving. Come on, y'all. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, I thank you. Hallelujah. God, I bless you. Hallelujah. God, I lift you up. Thank you for what could have been God. Thank you for what should have been God. Thank you for what he is God. And I bless your name. Help us to praise your better God. Help us to praise your better God. Help us to give you glory, God. Help us to give you glory, God. Help us to magnify your name. Help us to realize this is another opportunity. This is another chance. Somebody didn't get this opportunity. Somebody didn't get this chance. So help us to take advantage of it. In the name of Jesus. 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 Let the crowd get it. In the name of Jesus. 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 Yes, sir. Thank you, God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Don't give God the same praise you've been giving him. Don't give God the same praise you've been giving him. Come on, if you keep giving the same praise, you're going to keep getting the same thing. But I wish there was somebody who was going to say, I got a new praise to give God. I, I got more to give God. I might have not said hallelujah last year, but, but I made up my mind, I'm going to say hallelujah this year. I, I, I may have not said thank you Jesus last year, but I'm going to give it thank you Jesus this year. I, I may have not opened my mouth last year, but this year I'm going to open my mouth and I'm going to give God the fruit of my lips because he's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. Hallelujah, he's worthy. Hallelujah, he's worthy. Have I got anybody who can testify that he's worthy? Listen, maybe you don't jump, maybe you don't shout, but can anybody testify he is worthy? Come on, y'all, he is worthy. He is worthy. Anybody know he's a worthy God? He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy.
brought a hand by the bread. Come on, have you brought a hand by the Come on, put those hands together.
the Lord for that. We give him glory, we give him honor, we give the Lord praise because he is worthy of all of the praise. Amen. Everybody glad to be in the house of the Lord today? Amen. 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 We bless the Lord. We bless the Lord. A couple of, I guess about six months ago, uh, the Lord uh, instructed me to do something. Uh, and that is, every night before I go to sleep, uh, to um, have some personal, intimate time with him. Not prayer, not just prayer, but it's a time where I put on some music, some worship music, and I go to sleep. Um, noise is not something I like to usually do to go to sleep, so I knew it was the Lord when he said to do that. But usually when I wake up in the morning, um, there's always a song that speaks to me. And this is the song this morning. And we're going to try to do this. Uh, Brother Michael, get your microphone down. So the river will help me. Um, but the song says, I've had, my, I've had some problems, some great and some small. Yeah. You being God, delivered me from them all. I still can't believe. All the ways you made An incredible God deserves Incredible praise yeah. oh, 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 An incredible God deserves Incredible praise yeah. <laughs> Still can't believe all the ways you made. for the year, our theme for the year, found in John chapter 14. We're going to look at three verses. Thank you, Mr. Capon. Three verses. You know, the Lord often will give you something, but he won't give it all to you. And that's why it's important, the Bible tells us, to not walk in the counsel of the ungodly. Amen. The Bible says, though, that we are to be around godly people. And Amen. So I praise God. Amen for that. And so I praise God. I share this with and then Mr. Capon and the Lord I gave her the rest of it. And so I praise God for um, the confirmation and the completion of the work. I mean, know that God is doing a great thing. Yeah. Amen. 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 Y'all you know, like believe that God is doing a great Amen. thing. Amen. And I believe that great thing is going to start Amen. in me. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. And you have to tell yourself that great thing is going to start in me. Amen. And if it starts in you, then it will become contagious and amen. others will get it. St. John, chapter 14, uh, verse 12. We have it, say amen. Amen. If you don't have it, say wait. Uh, everybody got it. St. John chapter 14, verse 12. Notice you will find red letters. Here's Jesus talking. He says, Verily, verily, I say unto you, He that believeth on me, the works that I shall I do, shall he do also. And somebody said, Greater. Greater. Greater works than these shall he do. Little H there, which means it's me and you. Because I go unto my Father. 
And whatsoever, hallelujah. Amen. And whatsoever. And the old church would say, and whatsoever. <laughs> you shall ask in my name. That will I do. That the Father, hallelujah, may be glorified in the Son. If ye shall ask. Somebody say anything. Anything. Anything in my name. Pastor Fisher, I will do it. Three verses from St. John chapter 14. May the Lord have a blessing to the readers and the hearers and the doers of his just great word. Before you sit down, look at your neighbor say, Mega! Mega! Come on, say, Mega! Mega! Mega, you can be seated in the presence of the Lord. Come on, somebody say, Mega! Anybody believe Mega? Say, Mega! God, we bless you. We thank you. We praise you. We give you glory, honor. We magnify your name for you alone are God. And besides you, there is no other. Thank you, O oh God, for knowing that you are a great God. You do great things. You're getting ready to do even greater things Amen. for us. Thank you, O oh God, for knowing that eyes have not seen, ears have not heard, nor has it entered into the heart of man. The things that God has prepared for who? Them that love you and are called according to your purpose. I pray, my God, in the name of Jesus, that you will sustain Conrad. That you keep him right now. That you allow him to stand behind your sacred desk and proclaim your word. Yes. Lord, as I come to be a prognosticator of your word, I pray, oh God, that you would allow me to decrease, you increase, show yourself strong and mighty. Yes. We would see Jesus today. Amen. Show yourself strong and mighty. Show yourself as the capable and able God. Amen. Pray, oh God, that you let the words of my mouth, the meditations of my heart, be acceptable in your sight. For God, you are my strength, you are my redeemer. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Amen and amen. The Bible records that the grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of the Lord stands forever. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Praise God for each of you. We love you. And that us, you can get these. God bless you. Thank God. Look at your neighbor. Say, I'm glad you're here today. Come on, look at somebody you're really glad about being here. Say, I'm glad you're here today. I'm glad you're here today. Amen. Amen. Real glad you're here today. And that God bless each of you. Praise God for you. Happy New Year to you. We honor the Lord and that for His many blessings. Pastor Fisher is in the house today. Thank you, Pastor Fisher, for being here. Come on, applaud the Lord for Pastor Fisher being here today. My sister, my friend, I praise God for her. Thank God for all of our preachers who are here. And then praise God for your little creek, Minister Kate Park. Minister Kate Park. And then praise God for and then our deacons, Deacon Rivers, and then Deacon Gordon, uh, Deacon uh, Gray. And I thank God for Deacon Allen and his absence. And, and then all of our brothers and sisters who are here today. It's a blessing. Amen. It's a blessing. Amen. It's a blessing. Amen. To be in the house of the Lord Amen. on today. Give me a few minutes, if you will, to uh, prayerfully break this, um, break this down for you and our brothers and sisters. Every year, um, I ask the Lord to give uh, me something um, that will shape and will give direction to on what it is that we will do as a church. Uh, the Lord this year gave me this word, mega, M-E-G-A. And oftentimes when we hear this word, uh, we think of big, mm -hmm. think of large, we think of um, great. And the Lord said to me um, that everything we do in this new year should be mega. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Sometimes what we do is we limit mm. uh, what we can do based Amen. on what we have. Amen. Amen. We limit what we can do based yeah. on what we've done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We limit uh, what we do based on what people say mm -hmm. we can do. Amen. Can I submit to you, brothers and sisters, that oftentimes people will box you in places yes. Yes. based on their limits. Yes. Amen. Amen. Often what people will do, listen, listen, y'all let me just, just need to be, be real this morning. Often what we'll do is there are some people we will come in contact with, and y'all don't get mad at me this morning. It's a new year, y'all. Let's start with free year fresh. Nobody mad. Right? Often what we'll do is we will we will surround ourselves, uh, T. Lois, um, with people who never had anything. Right. Right. They never been right. anywhere. 
Right. And so because of their limitations, they will then place those limitations on you. There are some people, when I was teaching, when I was teaching, I'll never forget, I was teaching in St. Petersburg, and, and it was such a depressed uh, place where I, I worked. Um, when, when, I, when I took the kids on a field trip to Tampa, the problem was many of them had never left St. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And so the cause, the cause of the limitations that had been placed on their life, they did not realize that there was more than what they had seen. That's right. I'm trying to help somebody this morning. I'm trying to help somebody. I'm trying to help somebody. And so oftentimes what, what folk will do is because they've never been anywhere, they've never seen anything, and never had anything, they will think it's crazy when you start telling them what God says you can have. Yeah, you begin to tell people, God told me that I'm going to own my own home. Some folk get confused about that because they've never had to pay a mortgage. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Some folk, when you say, God told me I'm going to have a new car, that confuses some people because the only car that some folk have ever had is what someone else has given them. Yeah. And so when you say, God says, sometimes people get confused, Brother Walker, when you start driving around with two or three cars. understand this and understand that this is not a prosperity message. Right. In order to truly understand this, one must understand that when we get God, not only do we get God, but we get his benefit. Yes, 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 yes. 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 Say, preacher, what do you mean? I believe, I believe wholeheartedly that when we get in a relationship with God, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't mean a situation here. I don't mean an entanglement. Come on, y'all, help me today. I mean when we get in a covenant now. Somebody said, what is an entanglement? I, I don't mean one of those relationships where, where, where you're with him and with him. Come on, y'all, say that again. Who can be real today? I mean when you get in a committed and a covenant relationship with God, wherein you say, God, where you lead me, I will follow. God, what you tell me to do, I will do. What you tell, watch this, what you tell me not to do, I won't do, because I trust you enough to know that what you have for me is greater than the things I want. Have I got anybody who can testify that God got some great things for me, but in order for me to have the great things that God has for me, I gotta be willing to say I will not go after the things I want for myself because God, I understand if I do it your way, you're gonna give me better than what it is I want it on my own. So miss me with my own miss me with my own desires, miss me with my own flesh.
Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I got a whole year to preach on this, so it's all right. Mega. 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 Mega is something I've learned. I had to pray about this. I was walking yesterday around the church, and every one of you whose names I could remember, I called. Amen. I prayed. Amen. Amen. I prayed. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. I prayed. I prayed. And then the Lord, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I, I've been praying. I've been here now eight years in this world. I've been praying, God, help the people to see what I see. Amen. Amen. And then the Lord, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord said, Conrad, you just keep seeing. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Everybody's not going to see it, but, but you keep seeing it. Yeah. And you keep, hallelujah, yeah. thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Hallelujah, thank you. The Lord said, you keep seeing it. You, you keep saying it. Watch it. Cry loud and swear not. Lift up your voice like a trumpet. Show my people their transgression. How can Jacob their sin? God said, you see it. You do it. You go after it. You do what I say. Mega. I better 
should be mega. Yeah. Our worship should be mega. Yeah. Our service, hallelujah, should be mega. Yeah. When we come in the house of God, yeah. it should be mega. Yeah. Listen, listen, even if the choir not saying, can't part what I want to say, I can think about what God has brought me from. I can think about what God has done for me. Even if the musician not where I want to be, I can think about when I cried tears and the Lord dried the tears from my eyes. I can think about when I didn't believe I could live on. I, I can think about where the Lord has brought me from. I, I can think about what the Lord has done for me. I, I can think about what the Lord has taken me. I, I can think about the hurt I had to experience, the pain I had to experience, and something on the inside began to leap with joy. I feel good, y'all. I feel good, y'all. You know, when you have a little talk with Jesus and you tell him all about your troubles, you know he'll hear your faces cry. You know he'll answer by your back. You know when you just talk to Jesus and you say, Lord, I don't know how. Lord, I don't know who. Lord, I don't know where. But I trust that you're able. I trust that you can. I trust that you will. So I give you a mega praise. Somebody ought to stop right now and give God a mega praise. Come on, y'all. Somebody ought to give it. Somebody ought to give it. Somebody ought to give it a mega praise. I go and I come again to receive you. 
you to myself. That where I am, hallelujah, where I am. Y'all get too happy. Watch this. He says, and where I go, you know. Thomas says, wait a minute. I was with you in the beginning. But where are you going? Jesus said to him, he says, I am the way. I was looking on Facebook the other day and somebody started this thread and said, COVID go away in Jesus' name. And they said, somebody made a comment, if you keep saying that, it'll go away. And I, I started my comment on the, the thread and the Holy Spirit said, delete it. Yeah, amen. amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Because amen. you can't tell it to go away. Amen. But Jesus said, I'm going away. Yeah. And I'm going to come back yeah. to get you. Yes. So that where I am, yeah. COVID ain't there. Yeah. Yes. 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 Where I am, trouble ain't there. Yes. Can I tell you what the Lord got in my spirit? Can I tell you what the Lord got in my spirit? And that's not just heaven. No. No. Yes. Well, I thank you, sir. I hear the Lord saying, I've got some great things for you yes. here. Yes. And I'm going to be with you Inside 
There are jobs and better jobs. Amen. Amen. Inside of us. Amen. There is educational pursuits. Amen. Inside of us. Amen. Do you not realize that every great thank you, DJ. Do you not realize? Thank you, thank you. I got my amen today. I feel good today. Do you not realize that that every large organization, business, every large thing began with an idea. Amen. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Think about this. The story tells that this man named Walt Disney took a piece of paper and drew a rat with clothes on. Somebody want to be nice and say it's a mouse. But a mouse grows up to be a rat. Walt drew this mouse. Drew this mouse and went to this place in Central Florida that was nothing. With his picture of a mouse. Let that sink in for me. Now I can't draw. I can show the rights of that doesn't they? And to think that somewhere in Brother Walt's mind, mm -hmm. he envisioned that children yeah. and adults alike, mm -hmm. hallelujah, yeah. would be intrigued yeah. by a rodent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the mouse grew up. The mouse got him a girlfriend. Help me, Holy Ghost. Got him some friends. All in, ain't it? Got him some friends. It's a mess. A mouse with a girlfriend and some friends. I don't know how, but the mouse and his friends decided that they're not only going to be friends, but they're going to get some friends. So it's the divine. The mouse, his girlfriend, and their friends decided they were going to get some rides. Y'all yeah. <laughs> missing this. This is bigger than what y'all see. This is bigger than what you see. Yeah. Stay spiritual, see? Yeah. And, and the mouse, his girlfriend, the friends, and the rides decided that they were going to build an empire. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Think about it. Then, then the mouse the divine me you talking. Then the mouse decided that they were going to go to the big screen. Mm -hmm. And we're going to make some movies. Mm -hmm. But we're not going to just make little movies. We're going to what Tyree is. We're going to Hollywood. And while we're in Hollywood, we got a world in Florida. We're going to build a land in California. Disney World, hallelujah, yeah. on the East Coast. Yeah. Disneyland on the West Coast. But we're not going to forget about the Midwest and everywhere else. We're going to make sure that our production, hallelujah, extends not only in these 50 United States, yeah. but I believe if you go to Japan, yeah. the mouse is there. If you go to Jamaica, yeah, yeah man, the mouse is that y'all missing this today. Walt said, I'm going to do mega. Yeah. Well, I wonder if there's anybody who knows that a man named Jesus. Yes, sir. Yes. But before Walt was even a figment of his mother's imagination. Yeah. What do you mean he's going to do that?
woman and she shall bring forth a son. And thou shalt call his name Jesus. 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 Watch this. Here's the mega thing. Here's the mega thing. He's going to do more than change water to wine. Because if you and I get together, we can take some grapes, we can take some water, and we can make some wine. But I heard he's going to do more than that. The Bible declares he's going to do more than heal a sick man. Because if you and I go to college, get ourselves a medical degree, learn a little bit about medicine, we can prescribe some things that will help some people get better. He's going to do more than just that. He shall save. His people from their sin. I'm going to sit down when I tell you this part right here. I thought about, I get no notes. I thought about what's significant about a name. Yeah. And then I realized the M for Mega stands for meaningfully matter. Yes, sir. When I was born, I was born with the name Conrad. Mm -hmm. And my name in the beginning didn't mean much. Even right now, if we really be honest, my name really don't mean much. I was born with the name Son. <laughs> Time went on. I went to school. My name became Stuart. Yeah. 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 All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I grew up. I started working. And I've been working continuously yeah. since I was 14 years old. Yeah. My name at 14 became employee. Yeah. 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 I'm a better witness in here today. Yeah. Y'all yeah, help me get through this part right here now. Yeah. I got a little older, Kate Park. I saw Tiffany, I saw a girl. I like. My name became Boyfriend. Yeah. Hallelujah. Praise his holy name. Yeah. Time went on yeah. a little while longer. Yes, and then I saw another girl. Yes, I became somebody else's boyfriend. Yeah. Come on, y'all help me close. Don't get so spiritual. It's going to go somewhere in a minute. Is there anybody who knows 
his name. His name. His name matters. Preacher, how do you know his name matters? When I'm in trouble, backs up against the wall. Don't know which way to go. Tears fill my eyes. Hearts breaking in pieces. Nobody else is around. The nights get dark and cold. There's no help for me, it seems like. I'm so glad I know that I can get down on the knees. Anybody ever got down on the knees? Thank you, brother, you can trouble in. He died. Hallelujah, he died. He died there on an old rugged cross. I'm grateful this morning. I'm grateful this morning that as a new year has started, the same God still reigns. I had my share yes, sir. of ups yes, and downs. Yeah. Times when there seemed yeah. no one was around. Yes. But God yes. came and spoke yeah. these words yeah. to me. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes. I told y'all last Sunday, I'm going to keep on saying it. I don't want you to get tired of seeing me clap my hands. Yes. If you don't want to see me clap my hands, this might not be the place to come on Sunday. But I made it up in my little old mind that my praise is going to confuse the enemy. That my praise is going to take me higher. That my praise is going to lift me up. That my praise is going to take me down. That my praise is going to get me higher. That my praise is what's going to get me through. We've got a God bigger than our debt. We've got a God 
problems. And somebody better tap into their God and give him what to do. Amen. Come on, everybody stay here. Listen to me. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I, say, I miss what you're saying. I didn't hear it. I want us, among many things, to make some declarations. I believe that affirmations and declarations are important. I believe they're important. I believe, listen to me. I'm not going to say the preacher said this. I believe burning sage and all that is demonic. But I believe that through our mouths, we can declare and we can decree the blessing of the Lord, the favor and direction of the Lord. I told myself at work that I control my emotions. Yeah. That I lead with accountability. I tell myself that I parent with integrity. That I will teach my children the truth about Christ. Yes. Yes. The truth about life. Mm -hmm. I told myself that I would not um, perpetuate and pass down to them generational curses. Amen. Amen. That everything that happened in my family that was not positive before them stops yes. here. Amen. Preach, yes. yes. sir. Amen. Amen. I declare that my son Watch this. My son, my son will not deal with troubles. Amen. Hallelujah. That I dealt with. In the name of Jesus. That my daughters uh -huh. will be in meaningful relationships Hallelujah. with men who will Hallelujah. love them. Hallelujah. Hear me, Lord. Hear me. I declare that substance abuses Hallelujah. will not be their portion. Hallelujah. That lack would not follow Hallelujah, them. Thank you, Jesus. That poverty would not be their portion. Yes. Amen. And as I was walking through the church on yesterday and declaring and saying, I, God knows, I said, I look around and make sure I said everybody's name. And, and even those that came today that I didn't say your name, I said your name today. I declared, I declared in the name of Jesus Amen. that our lives, yes. watch this, our lives will begin anew and afresh. And the struggles that we had, hallelujah, would no longer be our struggle. Amen. Amen. We sing a song that St. Matthew says, you've been in this place oh, long enough. enough. And the mountainside has been rough. Yes. The struggle is over, is over yes. for you. Yes. I declare as a prophet of God in the name of Jesus, I declare that this will be the season Somebody say the year. This is the season. Yeah. And that the right, the right, the right harvest of the season would extend beyond the year. Yeah. Somebody say, this is my blessed year. You yeah. keep saying that. And that bothers me. Because if you're saying this is your blessed year, what about next year? All right. All right. So this is my season. Y'all with me? Amen. That the rest and the balance of my days would be positive. Yeah. And I'm going to live, hallelujah, to see it happen. Yeah. I'm going to walk in wealthy places. Right. Yeah. I'm going to sprint forward and do those things that God has purposed me to do. The things in your mind are not too large. They're just too large for some people. Right. And if it's too large for some people, they're not part of it. And that's okay, baby. Right. It's okay. Right. It's okay that people don't see what God right. said to you. It's okay. Right. It's okay. Right. It's okay. Right. Stick around, though. Stick around, though. Right. Yeah. Stick around so you can see it come to fruition. Because he's preparing a table before me in the presence of my enemies. He's going to allow you to stick around to see that it never be enough. I heard the Lord say, great. Somebody's gonna go to the doctor, Hallelujah. and the lab results are gonna change. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Come on, sister Keisha, go on. Yes, come on, sister, go on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, little Come on, 
Come on, Sister McCready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, listen, y'all. Listen, listen to me. This is where I'm at. I'm at God. I'm expecting you to do what you say. God, I'm expecting you. Come on, listen. Everybody may not get it. I'm expecting you to do what you say. I, I'm expecting you, God, to do what you say. So when it comes to pass, it's not a shock to me. It's just God doing what he said he was going to do. Yeah. I'm expecting God. Baby, baby, baby. Listen, I mean it in the most endearing terms. You know what I do. And no disrespect to you. Keep it going. Come on, keep it going. Come on with your wife. I expect God to do it for you.
Yes. Your blessing is coming. Yes, sir. Your blessing is coming. Your
take your rightful places. Be the man that God will desire for you to be. Do the works that God has instructed you to do. And in turn, God will bless you. He will pour out a blessing that you won't even have to receive. God, we pray for this anointed service today. Pray, God, that this won't be the last time that we come in and give you praise. That we forget about who's around us. Yes, sir. We forget about what we're going through. Yes, sir. We forget about what someone said to us. Yes, sir. Five, ten years, ten yes. years ago. But God, we get to a place where we get connected with you. So we won't ask the question. Who are you? What are you? What can you do? We already know that whatever we're going through, God can work it out. We serve a God that don't repair, but we serve a God that can fix it. We serve a God that can fix what has been broken. So God, we thank you today. God, if you continue to bless us, we'll be blessed. God, if you continue to keep us, we'll be kept. Most of all, God, if you continue, God, to save us and deliver us, we'll be saved and delivered. God, we thank you for all these many blessings. Thank you for all your people today, God. And we give your name praise, give your name glory, and we give your name honor. It is so in Jesus' name we pray. And all of God's people say amen. Amen. Say it again. Amen. Say it like you mean it. Amen. Glory to God. Man, at this time, man, I'm going to pray out. I'm going to talk about me again. Because I said on last year, amen, as we start to do this thing, we pray that you stop on the walking, get to a place where you need to be, and stay there until you are served. Amen? Amen. Amen. And amen.
ordinances of the Lord's church. And we believe that what Christ did through this is symbolizing his death. We believe that his body was broken for us. We believe that his blood was shed for us. And because of that belief, because of that confession, I declare in the name of Jesus that through this, because of this, through this, we can be healed. Amen. 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 Through this, we can be healed. Y'all believe that? Amen. Because of this, we can be healed. He says, as often as you do this, you do it in remembrance of me. His body was broken for us. His blood was shed for us. And so because of this, we can receive our healing. The Bible says that Jesus took bread. He broke it. He blessed it and said, take, eat. This is my body, which is broken for you. We eat the bread. He said, this cup is in the New Testament. My blood, which is shed for you, we drink the cup. And as often as you eat this bread and drink of this cup, you do it in remembrance of me. Jesus told his disciples, I'm not going to do this anymore with you here. But the next time we do this, y'all know we're going to be at We're going to be in paradise. Come on, you ought to give God praise. Yeah. Everything. We believe even in our giving. I told you one last week 
And then that we trust God even with our finances. Does anybody trust God with their finances? Amen. And I'm trusting that even Amen. in this new year, even in this new season, even in this new period that we're going through, I believe that God is going to show us how to be better stewards. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 Better stewards. I don't want to just come in the church and be blessed, but I want to live blessed even in my home. Amen. I will live better blessed when I go in the store. Yes. Come on, y'all. I want my credit score to reflect my blessing. Amen. Come on. Amen. I want my credit limits and credit opportunities to extend that. And I know that I'm going to do that. This is what the Lord told me. And maybe he didn't tell you that. But he told me that the way that I'm going to be blessed is through my giving. Amen. And as I give, Amen. and he's going to give, yes, press down, shake it together, run it over. I was in the store with Elder McCree yesterday. Little went the store he yesterday. I was trying to buy everything that he had. He said, no. And I said, oh. He said, I need to get rid of this so I can get what God has given me. I didn't think about it until I got home. When he was saying, I gotta get rid of the money in my wallet. Yeah. So that more money can come in. Yeah. Y'all missed that. Y'all missed that. Yeah. I got home and I said, Well, I'm gonna be like him. So let me give everything I got. Yeah. So the Lord can replace it with more. Yeah. And that's a concept of maturity that someone gives. Right. Yeah. But I want us to be able to be blessed. Right. And listen, I never, I would never put a money amount on what we give. Because I think that limits God and limits Amen. us. I learned that from I learned that from Deacon Harold. Deacon Harold said, "Stop telling people to give just five dollars. The Lord might want to give five hundred dollars. So if that's what the Lord tells you to do. Deacon Harold, do it. But I want us to be blessed. I want us to be mature in our blessing. So we're going to give today. We're going to give today, not just today, but we're going to give going forward. We're going to give the best that we have. And we know that as we're giving the best, God's going to bless us. I told you all last week. I am believing God for our homes." I'm believing God for increases in our finances. Amen. I'm believing God for increases in our businesses. Amen. I'm believing God for new businesses. Amen. For jobs and for better jobs. Amen. For opportunities. Anybody believing that with me today? Amen. I'm believing God for our divine healing. I'm believing God for our new in every area, in every aspect. I believe God is going to do that. Yeah. And Lazarus, even the things in our lives that are dead that should not be dead, Amen. I'm declaring that we're going to call them forward Amen. and they're going to live. We're going to call them by his name. Lazarus, yeah. come forward and live. And we declare that. Anybody believe that today? And we declare it in Jesus' name. As we give today, oh God, we're not giving blood and necessity, but God, we know that you love a cheerful giver. Today, God, we're giving you the fruit of our loins. We're giving you, oh God, the fruit, the fruit of our being. We're giving you, God, the fruit and of our increase. Bless us as we give today and help us to realize that we're not giving grudgingly or necessity. We're not giving haphazardly, but we're planting these seeds in good ground and we're expecting a good harvest in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Come on, y'all don't believe that. Amen. Amen. I want us to get excited about giving. Amen. 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 And amen. I was going to ask a question. Uh, even Pastor just went through everything he did. I really want to, uh, this is just for a pastor. So, those of us that have an understanding of tithes, you keep your hand down. But those of us that really don't have an understanding of what tithes and offering really is, put your hand up like me. If you really don't have an understanding and need better information on it and on what God is requiring from us in just that. So all of us have a true understanding and feel in our heart of hearts that we know everything that it is to know about tithes and offering and how we're really supposed to be given. Amen. 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 All right. Amen. Watch out. Watch out. Uh, so you can take charge.
some mad dog. Big baby hug me. That's some mad dog. Come on, come on. Let's go. He don't go home. I'll help y'all, Lord. I'll help But to God be the glory for the great things that God has done. I'm excited, y'all. Amen. Anybody else excited? Amen. I'm excited about what the Lord is doing. I'm excited about what the Lord is going to do. Pastor Fisher is here. I, I would be wrong. Pastor Fisher, just tell us, tell us, tell us, tell us something. We praise God for you being here. Come on, Pastor Fisher. Don't look at us like that. Come on. <laughs> praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord.
and I'm now going to be the proud great grandmother of a set of twins because they found out she was pregnant. Oh, so come May, I'll be the proud great grandmother of a set of twins. Thank God. I just want to thank God. Thank you. Hallelujah. I want to thank God for, uh, for being in this church and thank you God for, for all your prayers because my mom is coming home tomorrow. Amen. 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 And to fix her mic too much of ours and, um, and she's doing well. She, there's nothing wrong with her. She just has... Her uh, her lungs have been compromised from being, you know, her heart being leaky and everything. But she's coming home tomorrow, and just you know, thank you for your prayers. And just thank God for doing great things in my life, and my mom's life, and everyone else, all of my family's life, and everything. I just just thank God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Facebook or anything, I always pray for a brother and sister early. I tell you this, one of the most difficult days in my life, God knows I won't forget. I made it to work that day and I got there I said, oh God. And uh, I looked up and I said, there's somebody downstairs to see you. And um, I think he had just got off work that night. He was working overnight. And they drove to St. Pete to sit in my office to pray with me. And I will never forget. And man, I believe that, man, that God Gave me strength that day uh, to make it through and then because of that prayer that day. And so I pray uh, for them. I want you to, I, I said this again, I want you to lift him up. Yeah. yeah. And then it's, it's, I didn't realize um, the, um, the great physical and mental anguish yeah. that goes into being able to learn um, to serve and protect us. And while we feel however some people feel about law enforcement, listen to me, I told you about this, I'd much rather have them. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Come on, somebody. I'd much rather have them than not. I have a job. I do not want. And so I praise God for him, and I praise God for his wife. And then for their children. I pray, God, I pray that you will continue to keep them lifted in prayer. Yeah. And that they're doing great work. Amen. Amen. All Amen. ministry is not in the church. Amen. 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 So for the Bible, I, I look forward to the post. Yeah. Amen. Some of them crazy as a bed, bro. But I pray God. Yeah. If you not, if you friend of us on social media, don't don't add them, but I praise God. I praise God for her and for the encouragement amen. and then for and then all that she's doing and for all of you. And I pray amen. that this be the year that we see Mega. I hear you, sister, sister. Uh, this is this is this is my season for Mega, yeah. and I'm trusting God to do it. Amen. It's our it's our season. Our season. That season is now. Yeah. And we planted the seed. Come on, y'all stand. We planted the seed, and now it's time to watch them grow. Amen. Can we thank God for all of you who are here today? Amen. And so you have seen a lot. We praise God for you. We thank God for you. And we pray that God will continue to bless you. We pray that God will keep you. Amen. Look at somebody. Say, may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord bless you and keep you.
And he calls his spirit to shine upon you. And he calls his spirit to shine upon you. And be gracious to you. May he lift up his smile upon you. And give you peace. Come on, declare this with conviction. Say, I believe. I believe. I believe. That mega is my portion. And I will receive everything that I believe in. God bless you. God bless you.